Hi guys and welcome to Intuition Study Services. In today's episode of Lightning Maths, we'll be looking at a really quick and easy way of how to multiply numbers between 10 and 20 in seconds flat. Now before we begin, it would be good to know all the times tables from 1 to 9. And if you need any extra help with your upper 6, 7, 8 and 9's times tables, then check out this video or click on the link in the description below which will help you get a handle on these times tables. You can also check out all the other times tables in the multiplication section of this channel. Okay, so let's take a look at an example. Let's consider 12 times 14. Okay, so step one, what we do is first of all, we find out how far each number is away from 10. So the 12 is two digits away from 10 and the 14 is four digits away from 10. Then step two, what we do is we add diagonally. So we can do 14 add two and that gives us 16. We can notice that we also get the same answer if we did 12 add four. It doesn't matter which order you do it, as long as you add diagonally. So we got 16 as the first part of the answer. And then what we do, step three, is we multiply these distances away from 10. So these numbers at the bottom, so there's two times four is eight. So the answer is 168. And it's that simple. Let's take a look at another example. Let's consider 15 times 15. Okay, so step one, we find out how far each number is away from 10. So 15 is five away from 10. Same with the other 15. Then we add diagonally. So 15 add five gives us 20. So that gives us the first part of the answer. Then we multiply these distances. So that's five times five is 25. Now, because we have a two digit number here, we put down the units first and we carry the two. So that gets added to the zero. So that becomes 225. Let's take a look at another example. Let's consider 17 times 19. Okay, so step one, find out how far each number is away from 10. So the 17 is seven digits away from 10 and 19 is nine digits away from 10. Then we add diagonally. So we can do 17 add nine or 19 add seven, get the same answer either way. And that gives us 26. So we put that down. Then we multiply these distances. So seven times nine gives us 63. We put down the three first and we carry the six and we add that six to the 26, making 32. So the final answer is 323. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll leave you with these three questions for you to try. You can pause the video and I'll join you in a few moments. Okay, so let's take a look at these three questions. Number one, 11 times 13. So first of all, we find the distances away from 10. So 11 is one away from 10 and 13 is three away from 10. Adding diagonally, either way, 11 plus three gives us 14, same as 13 plus one. And then multiplying these distances, one times three is three, so the answer is 143. Number two, 16 times 17. Okay, so the 16 is six away from 10 and the 17 is seven away from 10. And then adding diagonally, either way, 17 plus six gives us 23, which is the same as 16 plus seven. And then multiplying these distances, so six times seven gives us 42. We put down the two and we carry the four, add the four to the three, and that gives us 272. Number three, 19 times 19. So step one, each number is nine digits away from 10. And then adding diagonally, 19 plus nine, gives us 28 and then 9 times 9 is 81 so put the 1 down carry the 8 the 8 gets added to the other 8 so that's 28 add 8 gives 36 so therefore the answer is 361 so if you do this a few times you'll be able to do these multiples in a matter of seconds and it will become effortless let me know how well you did with these in the comments below Okay, so everybody should have done well on those, but if you feel you need a bit more practice, then feel free to rewind this video and you can work through the technique again. If you found this tutorial helpful, then do leave a like, comment, share with anyone who you think this could benefit, and do subscribe for all the latest lightning maths tips, tricks, revision and exam techniques. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.